Hello friends, in this video I will show you how to convert a string array into a list string and into an array list string. So this is a string array with name fruits and it contains these five items and these each of these items are separated by a comma and each item is in double quotes because each item is a string. So it contains strings separated by comma and I will convert it into a list string and array list string. So to convert it into a list string we only have to write uh, we have to define a new list string here I have named it fruit underscore list and this will be equal to arrays dot as list fruits which is the array. So this is the array and the list called fruit list will be arrays dot as list fruits. And if we have to convert it into an array list, we can first define the array list. Like here I can write array list string and we can write the name of the array list. Here the name of the array list is my list. So I will write my list. Array list string my list is equal to new array list. So this will define a new array list and then we can add this list string to it for that we can write my list dot add all this one fruit list so if I write my list dot add all fruit list then it will be converted into this array list string Okay, but if I have to display it in a list view in Sketchware, then I need a block for it. And because if I have to use this block and put this my list here, I need a block for my list. So here I've created a list string called my list, and it is same as writing this code. Okay, so I can remove this code, and this code is already written below, so I will remove this. Okay, so now I have declared and defined my list as a new list and then I have added all the fruit list, all these items from this list string to this array list string which is my list and then I can display it in list view. Now the use of converting the arrays to list is that in this list we can write, con we can use contains, so you can use if this fruit underscore list dot contains and we can write anything here then close this and we can use this code okay if the fruit list contains and similarly we can use the same code for this my list also which is an array list string and the, in sketch where we can use blocks for that also Okay, so in this view area I have this list view one in which I display this array list string which is my list and I have an edit text one and text view one. In edit text one if uh, the list string contains the character sequence in edit text one then this text view two will display yes otherwise it will display no and that I have set in edit text one on text change. So my list is the array list string if my list dot contains underscore character sequence underscore character sequence is this block so if it contains underscore character sequence text view 2 dot set text yes else text view 2 dot set text no and that's all now let's check this So here you can see the list view displaying the items in the arrays and now if I search for anything like if I write A it says the list doesn't contain A and if I write apple it says yes and then if I write mango then also it says yes and if I write something else for grapes it says yes but 
if i extend the text it says no so that's on this video thank you very much for watching this